my brother actually saw the guy driving off and he has windows rolled down and I'm not exaggerating. Cole jumps through the passenger side window, grabs the steering wheel and the guy speeds off on the highway and my brother's legs are like kicking out the side of the thing. What? Hi, I'm Hannah Marks. And I'm Dylan Sprouse. And we're here to... Share our worsts with Elle. Before we get started, please be sure to check out our movie, Banana, Banana Split. Split, out now. All right, worst kiss. Yes. Mm. I have had me? one. <laughs> I have had one. My worst kiss, maybe just any kind of kiss I had as a kid on set acting in something, because that's a really awkward and nerve-wracking. Yeah. yeah, when I was 16, she tried to eat my face. Like, mm. it was very, like, my lips were, like, this this big. Yeah, that's not and good. Her, she was, like, all over the face. Yeah. Yeah. Or someone that just... And does, you can smell it at that point. Someone you know? that does tongue that you don't that you mm -hmm. don't want. Yeah, yeah no. Yeah. Mm -mm. Worst audition. Okay, my worst audition, it was one of my first ones when I was a little kid, was Malcolm in the Middle. I threw up in the room. <laughs> I had uh, I had the flu and it was like 110 degrees in the valley. Oh, you told me this. Yes, I threw up literally on camera and then continued to throw up in the waiting room and threw up on a girl's shoes. That's awesome. So that one takes the cake for sure. How about you? Uh, mine was uh, an audition for Thing 1 and Thing 2 with my brother for the Dr. Seuss Cat in uh -huh. the Hat movie. Okay, for some reason I thought you were going to say School of Rock or something. No, 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 that one was bad though too. Oh, okay, great. Oh yeah, that one was bad too. No, what this happened one was to the that worst. Uh, thing one and thing two? Uh, they just said, go wild. <laughs> we were in a gymnasium and they just <laughs> said, go wild. And what my brother and I interpreted that as was like, just beat the shit out of each other. <laughs> wow. And so we just wrestled. And then we got angry as kids do at each other and then we stormed out. Oh my goodness, that's... Suffice to say, I mean, we are not thing one, thing two. I could see that getting you guys the part, though, in something else. Yeah, something else. Something else. Yeah. Worst look, I would say, was just, like, all of puberty. Probably. <laughs> my worst look is I had a derby hat phase. A derby hat phase? Yeah, like the bowl-shaped... Yeah. I had a phase. Worst look. Mm -hmm. Makes had, me cringe to this I, day. I had it in like fifth grade. I had a little punk face and I wore like the fishnet sleeves. Oof. Oof. Rough. Not good. Rough. Mm. I straightened my hair once. Oh. Yeah. Well, like and did the swoop. Yep. Like, the Bieber swoop. Yeah. Pre but I only did it one day. I tried it. You don't need, you got straight hair. No. No. This was. There was emo. It was the emo. emo yep. This was scene. It was the emo scene. Yeah. MySpace days. Bad news. Yeah. Bad news. Mm -hmm. Worst date, uh, I'm a very sweaty guy, hence why my hands are like this one. <laughs> one time I decided to wear a light green shirt to a date mm -hmm. and was pitted basically down, because I was so nervous. Oh no. Pitted all the way down to my waist, pretty much. Oh, uh, well that's kind of sweet in a weird way that you were, no. <laughs> no, not great. come on. Uh, worst date, I don't, I don't know how to answer that. Probably, oh, gosh that's hard without I don't know how to say it. Without ratting them out? <laughs> yeah, how do you not rat the person out? Are you a out? snitch? <laughs> I'm kind of a snitch. I know, I just can't I can't be a snitch, sorry. Can't do it. That's respectable. I don't have a good sweat story like you. <laughs> yeah, well, the problem is is that, see, me telling that story is completely non-denominational. Everyone I've ever been on a date with would be like, that was my date. That was, yeah. <laughs> no, but at least that one doesn't rat anyone out. That's so true. So that's good. Worst breakup. You go. Oh, great. I guess probably my breakup with my high school boyfriend, just because <clears throat> that was the most monumental and the, you know, first and longest relationship. So that breakup is always really hard. Yeah. How about you? Mm, never broke up. Never broke mm, up with anyone. Yep. You're still dating. Yeah, I just eight got. Women. I got on a boat and mm -hmm. I just sailed away. Mm -hmm. Yeah, into the sea. That's the ultimate ghosting. Yeah, no, well, it's not ghosting. It's more like forlorn sailoring. I, they could still think that I'm in a relationship, but I don't know. But honestly. How does Barbara feel about this? And she knows my love of the sea. Okay. Yeah. 
I mean, in Banana Split, our characters break up, and I think it's uh, a, a really hard thing for them to deal with because it's first love. So that's always really scary, and the stakes feel so much higher in that situation. Yeah, and you're just very emotional at that age in general. Oh, yeah. yeah. So hormonal. And a lot of a lot of spikes in those mm-hmm. emotions. Mm-hmm. So it's always particularly crushing. But yeah, I was I was homeschooled, so I didn't experience the high school part of the high school relationship. That's good. Just, you don't want just that Just the relationship at that age. Yeah. 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 Worst interview. <laughs> Worst interview. Oh. It's not an interview necessarily, mm-hmm. but I, I do have stage fright in front of an intimate amount of people. Like it, it not mm. a lot of people, I get that. but enough. And I had to do a, uh, I had to do, I had to stand up in front of the class and like do like a class oh. assignment. Yeah, that would scare me. And uh, yeah. I stuttered for like two minutes straight until someone in the class was just like, sit down. <laughs> Oh no. Yeah. And so that wasn't, it's not an interview, but it felt like it was one. Yeah. I guess my worst interview is still Malcolm in the Middle. <laughs> it's just burned in my brain. That's yeah. definitely a trauma. Yeah. <laughs> okay, worst dinner. What do you think? Any dinner where I had to eat with you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's crazy because my worst dinner is eating with you. Why? Wow. you made me have escargot. That's what goes good. Did not like it. So slimy. A little chewy. So slimy. If you like garlic, you'll like it though. Mm-mm. Yeah, also, had... it was it was upstate New York escargot. That's not really where. Just to earlier have. today, you explained to me how risky it was for you, like your risky item of scrambled eggs with ketchup. You're like, oh, that's I'm true. Whoa. I, like, I just like sides, <laughs> and I just said that that was delicious. Okay, I like beige foods. I like to keep it pretty tame. You're more of a risk taker. That's just. I, Anyway, uh, moving on. Where's the party? Hmm. Any party at any of the clubs in New York City or LA. That's, uh, that's your worst party. Yeah. I feel, I'm not really a partier, so I don't have a, a worst party. You know me, I like to stay at home. <laughs> I like the French bulldog vibe. I, I like to hang with my dogs. Yeah, no, yeah, I'm not much of a partier either, but definitely the parties that I do go to, you think it'll be a fun vibe where mm-hmm. people are gonna dance and cut loose, and instead it's like a lot about watching other people do things. I feel like everyone too is always on their phones. Yeah. So, yeah. not that exciting. Worst vacation. vacation. Oh, goodness. Yeah. I went to Hawaii on a double date once where the Ooh. couple was seemed like they were in the middle of breaking up. Oof. Yeah. Yeah. My that... friend, uh, she literally dug a hole in the sand. And what'd she do with it? She sat in the hole. <laughs> Did they break up in the hole? No, she just was <laughs> sad, so she dug a hole and sat in it for a while. That's so depressing. I mean, imagine being so sad that you decide to dig. Dig. It's <laughs> crazy. Most people just like sit on the couch or go to sleep. She's like, no, nah, I gotta She's dig. She's like, I'm gonna dig a literal <laughs> hole. So that was, that was uh, I mean, that vacation was good, but that part was awkward. Worst vacation, also the best vacation. Uh, recently took a family trip to Italy and we were traveling all up and down the Amalfi Coast. It was the best vacation, it was so awesome, but it had the worst moment, which uh, our entire car got robbed <gasps> of all of our oh, belongings. No. My brother actually saw the guy driving off and he has windows rolled down, and I'm not exaggerating, Cole jumps through the passenger side window, grabs the steering wheel, and the guy speeds off on the highway while my brother's legs are like kicking out the side of the thing. What? Yes. That's so we're crazy. tearing down after him at the thing. Anyway, long story short, it ended all right. Um, Holy cow. Yeah. That's crazy. He's punching the guy in the face and everything. So why? No. I swear. I could not make it up. People always sing that. Yeah, that yeah. sounds like a movie. No, it was actually it was the craziest thing. Wow. Worst rom com, uh, The Other Sister. <laughs> what, what's the what's no the, worst uh, worst rom com? Hmm. None of these you would be able to actually post because they're that bad. They're worst, actually oh, made I in know, a time um, when they're so rom-com. offensive. Like right, um, tiptoes, tiptoes. That's tiptoes. literally what worst I was gonna say. Tiptoes. Ever. I've actually just seen the trailer like a thousand times because it's so. Have you fascinating. not watched it? I've no, I've never watched it. Oh all my the way god. Through. 
The ending is insane. This movie is crazy. If you haven't seen the Tiptoes trailer, go watch it. My favorite part is when it goes, in the role of a lifetime, Gary Oldman. <laughs> Do you know that part I'm talking about? <laughs> it's insane. Yeah, honestly, Definitely watch that. Worst advice. I would say my worst advice would be to like stay in my lane or stick with just one thing like acting or directing. I think it's totally okay to not be in a box and try to do everything yeah. you want to do. Uh, worst advice was uh, generally just wait for something to happen. Ooh, that's bad. Yeah, and I'm just like, no, there's never been a moment where something good has been delivered on a plate. Totally you know, agree. You have mm -hmm. to kind of grab it yourself. Always. Totally agree. <laughs> oh, okay, worst fear. <laughs> worst fear for me? Mm -hmm. Thalassophobia. What's that? It's the fear of dark water and what's underneath. Oh, that's so scary. Yeah. Uh, I, yeah, I don't like spiders. Definitely not. I don't like hikes. Uh, heights? Wow. Hikes. hikes too. I don't like hikes. Because <laughs> of the spiders. Hikes and heights and spiders. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. But I think all fears are inherently bad, right? I have an unrealistic fear of giant squids too. And I think it's linked to this, the lassophobia. Is that just, do you like dream giant squids? Yeah, like squids. Like, what, what are your worst nightmares? <laughs> I think dark water dreams. Yeah, yeah. Where I'm like in the water and I'm- I don't like being chased. And there's something being underneath chased. me, like in the water. I know that there's something that could come up and drag me down. That's terrifying. Yeah. I don't like that. I think I must have, uh, must have been a pirate in my past life. Captain Jack Sparrow? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I fell overboard mm -hmm. and a giant squid got me, obviously. That's why I have that fear today. Okay, worst subject in school. Worst hmm. subject. What is yours? Probably math. Yeah. I'm more of an English girl. Yeah. I was always so, very good at history, terrible at math. Mm, yeah. I feel like I, I would like history more now as an adult because I feel like when I was younger, the only thing I really learned about history was from movies. Mm. You know? No, I learned in those classes. Okay, cool. Yeah, I was right. homeschooled, so. Yeah. <laughs> this is go. the history of this house. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Thanks for watching us play Worse with L. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and check out our new movie, Banana Split.